Hey there, my name is Matthew with Red, White & Used here in Columbus, Georgia, and this is a 2001 Ford F-250. This one is the Lariat, and it is a Platinum Edition. Basically, they made a little under 2,500 of these trucks in 2001 to celebrate the millionth Super Duty being made. So they made the Platinum Edition to celebrate that in 01. So what was the Platinum Edition? You got the fully loaded Lariat truck. They gave you the special two-tone dark gray on silver color combo. On the inside, they did the dark gray and lighter gray leather interior. Skinner console, heated seats, power windows, power lock, cold AC, and just a really cool color combo with the darker carpet and the truck in general. No used cars perfect, however, something that is now what, 23 years old? With 260 on it, it's definitely in good shape. As we get closer, we are going to find minor nicks and scratches throughout the truck, all the way around it, that have been touched up. She sounds healthy. And little dings and dents, because she is a used truck at the end of the day. She is not a show queen. She is a platinum that you can enjoy. As we take a look on the inside, we've got the Edge Tuner. This one's got its different tunes you can run, depending on how you're going. I've never turned it past drive because I'm an old man and trucks are not made to go fast. Seat bottoms are in very good shape. Seat backs are in good shape. Center console, we are missing the clip. Other than that, it's in good shape though. We got a radio here, cup holders, super cold AC, heat works, all that good stuff. Four wheel drive on the fly, it works as it should. 264 on the dash. Take a look at the back seats. A little bit of wear, but nothing crazy. A little wear on the gray as well. You know, it's a used truck, so it's not perfect. I'm not gonna sit here and play that. What's in the box? Well, the front door lock actuators work power the way they should. So you press the little unlock or lock button, it works the way it should. The rears do not, so you gotta go old school to lock and unlock this thing. Not the end of the world for an older truck, but it is what it is. This does have a bed cover. It does have some wear on the bed cover, but if it was my truck, I'd rather have a worn bed cover than none at all. We got a bed, and uh, it's a truck. It's been used as one. We do have helper bags in the back. I have not tested them. I'm not gonna lie to you. They are plumbed up to this little thing right here by the license plate. So it's kind of cool. You're ready to air up when you're towing your trailer and all that fun stuff. We've also got some 2010 style 6.4 mirrors on here. We got those 6.0 headlights. Let's pop that hood for you. Ba -doop -ba -doop. Baby. There we go. So, there's that edge shooter I was telling you about. It's a, I don't know if it's the bigger turbo or not. Turbo by Derek. That, that pipe has me thinking something's been done to it, but I don't want to tell you the wrong thing. I'm not too sure. But she's a 7.3 and she is a healthy 7.3. It's got an intake and exhaust on it, and it runs and drives great. I've put four or 500 miles on this one, something like that. If I didn't have a 6.7 King Ranch, this would be my truck. She's not perfect, but she runs and drives very good. If I can answer any questions and provide any additional information on this truck, my name is Matthew Davis. My email is sales at redwhiteused.com. My website is redwhiteused.com. My address is 1020 Veterans Parkway in Columbus, Georgia. And my phone number is 706-327-4107. Now, she does have some surface rust on her, by the way. However, cab corners, rockers, all that stuff are clean. There's just some minor surface rust on the frame. I figure I'd show you that while it's here. Thanks, y'all. Hope you have a wonderful day.